Hello once again, YouTube, and welcome to another exciting episode of Kev Bob's Probably Gonna Blow Up Really Hilariously. Now, I just want to point out a few things here. I may have gone a little overboard, but I just wanted to demonstrate that we have these awesome decouplers here, which spread everything out, so there's no touching parts, there's no like overheating issues gonna happen. We have this tricoupler. I don't really use them that often, but I'm gonna use them this time just to sort of showcase that tricouplers are a thing where you basically turn one rocket into three rockets. Uh, then we have our two stages here, and then we have all the batteries. This is a very heavy part. It's I imagine that it's going to just turn upside down <laughs> when I try to launch it. Um, so anyway, so we got these three, and then all the decouplers at the same time, and then So this is going to be interesting because I don't think it's going to have as much thrust. Also, all of this crazy tape looking stuff is there specifically to hold the thing together while it is in trajectory so the parts don't fly apart because that's probably what will end up happening. Whoa, 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 whoa. Fuck. I just wanted to copy the wing a -ling. Okay. So what we're going to do here is we're going to put these guys on it again because that was the smartest thing I've ever done. That'll work. Okay. So, this is the Kev R4. Save and launch. This one's going to Minmus. And then once we're at Minmus, we're going to take pictures. This thing could probably land. Like if I had put these down here, maybe it could have landed. I should have done that. Anyway, we are going to go all balls out and fuck Minmus. Okay. And we still have a little bit of fuel left in these. That's good. Eh. Not exactly the most efficient design, I'll admit. Considering I basically blasted straight. Look at that. 1545. 44. We have a lot of batteries. So why don't we make the best of them? Observe Mystery Goo. Send for science. Observe Mystery Goo. Nope. 
I don't keep that data. Whatevs. Oh shit. Okay, we need this guy to level off at the 90 degree here. I'm a little off center, but that's okay. You would be too if you had to fight against weird gravity because of your strangely dick shaped. I made a giant space dick. Okay. <laughs> I'm so proud. I'm sure my parents are too. Alright. We're gonna get up there. Lasts at about eight seconds, I think, before the end lasts. Okay, thirteen, twelve, eleven, ten, nine, eight. so much time that I'm going to waste a whole lot of fuel trying to get this to work. Let's get we'll just do it like this. Come on. Come on. Come on, 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 come on. I believe in you, Harvey Dent. I believe in you. Mm. Oh yeah, we got this. We got this. Okay, so we're going to get our periaps to here, sure. Perfect. Now we have to figure out... We set this as our target. First we need to... And our eccentricities gone. <laughs> like so. So we need to find This thingy here is what we have to hit. I don't know if I've been mentioning that or not. Uh, no time, no time, no time. Oh. Good enough. Alright, now we just need to figure out how we get from here to the moon. So you see these little arrows here? This is target position. This is where we'll be at that point. So by the looks of it, we need to go earlier. Fuck. Hmm. Oh, there. That's where we'll see it. Just like shit. <laughs> well, Probably missed the window, but that's okay. <laughs> All 
All right. It's going to take a while because this friggin' thing goes so slowly. Now you see how it's expanding so quickly. 8 million, 9 million, 13 million, etc. I think this is going to collide us with it. Let's just clear this up a little. Uh, no, not quite. We do get a periaps though. That's awesome. We'll shrink that down when we get there. <laughs> Hooray! We're going to Min Miss. Min Miss is so much easier than the Mun. I could probably land on it. Whoa, what the fuck just happened? We're gonna hit the moon on our way back, too. That's weird. I think we just did. No. I don't know what's going on. Uh, let's go like this. This is going to plow us right into Minmus. Yeah, if I'd put these down here, I could have landed. I'm a fool. That's okay, we'll land next time. And then we're going to just carpet bomb the Mun with landings. Okay, so... Still pretty much too small to see far away, I should say. It's always going to be too small. But now we should be able to see it. Fine and dandy. min Uh, no. That's... Come on. That's exactly the opposite direction. There it is. I feel like Goku when I say that. Min? Oh, oh, oh! Okay. <laughs> that was frightening. Okay, now we are going to do experiments. Why can't we do experiments? What the hell? Reset. So a mystery view. Ah, it's inoperable after transmitting, that's why. So we're gonna keep the data. We're gonna do a crew report real quick. Actually, we're going to do a crew report and send it. For maximum of the science. And then we're going to do an EVA report real quick. <sighs> Keep it bored. View stored data. Transmit. All right. Now then. We can probably land, but it will take a lot of our fuel remaining.
We need to raise our apsis, periapsis. So if we go like this. That does nothing. Right, I'm an idiot. We need to pretty much go the exact opposite direction. And make sure you get it high up because Minmus has huge mountains. And what's this going to do to our trajectory here? Okay, so then we can go out to the apoapsis here and just shrink our periapsis down. And we're golden. We can shrink our periapsis a little bit compared to that, though. Right. We can probably go down to about 8,000 meters. I think that will count as being close. Alright, yeah, that should be fine. Okay, here we go, baby. Math, who needs math? Oh, Jesus. Look how close we are. You could almost touch it. Ooh, Minmus got thingies. That's neat. Right. I tried to do it too quickly. So these are lowlands. So then I must have highlands, right? It's probably also got lakes. How interesting. It's got its own little biomes. They added that. That's what they said they were going to do too. That's great. Okay, well, we will, uh, continue on, onwards and upwards, as they say. far. And we shrink our periapsis. Look, we're doing the exact same thing we did last time. Just gonna bomb Kerbin. That was a weird texture clip thingy. Oh well. Okay, we are going to land like bitches. Watch this. I wanna hit Earth. I wanna hit sea. Right now I'm on a trajectory. 
trajectory course for C. It's basically Let's see what happens. That's steadily shrinking, of course. It's out to a million kilometers, though, or a million m meters, a thousand kilometers. Holy crap, here we go, baby. Come on. Shrink more. Hitting the ocean sucks because I might lose an experiment, and I don't want to do that. Also, I wanted to use my legs, see? Oh well. Balls. And we have... What's up? One hundred and seventy-eight science. Oh my god! All right, so what are we gonna buy this time? We're gonna get the cheaty McCheat tool for ninety. That's half of the science I just got is going into that. And then we should probably get these things, so I can get that and also that and droid head. Bam. Okay. So far so good, am I right guys? I'm so right, right? Soon we'll get you photovalic panels. And whatever you are, processing lab? Tiniously <laughs> combustless. <laughs> Previous one also has the equipment as you clean out and store functionality. Inoperable. Oh, that's a good thing to have then. Okay, so now we have our plan. Next, we'll get probably this because I'm an idiot and I'll forget. Hydraulic detachment manifold. Interesting. Gigantic decoupler. Oh hey, I got RCS now. Alright, this means I have to land on the Mun. Well, probably Minmus first and then the Mun. 
Although there's biomes now. That's really interesting. I'm going to just... Hmm. If I could make a rover of wood, and I'll just go all over Minmus. be boring as balls, but I could do it. Anyway, thanks for watching. And next time we will land on Minmus, walk around, gather some samples, and then scoot on back to the homeworld here.